The valley of the Derbyshire Derwent, as it was nine years ago when work on the huge Lady Bar Reservoir began. Today, the valley presents a different aspect. A six million pound enterprise, the finished reservoir covers more than 500 acres. 50,000 tons of local gritstone were used on the dam. The project brought work to the area, and also some regrets, for the pleasant village of Ashopton and many hamlets had to be submerged when the valleys were flooded. For the official opening of the reservoir, the King, accompanied by the Queen, made the 12-mile drive from Sheffield. The King first unveiled a tablet commemorating the opening ceremony. The first Derwent Valley water scheme goes back to 1889. The Lady Bar Reservoir is its greatest achievement. Later, the King deposited a copper cylinder under a three-ton block of stone containing newspapers and coins of 1945. A find for historians if archaeologists ever have to sort out the ruins of the atomic age. The 320-foot depth of water will contain more than 6,000 million gallons. Many people brave transport difficulties to see the king open the valves to release the first head of water. Sheffield, Derby, Leicester and Nottingham will draw water from the Lady Bar Reservoir. An impressive conclusion to nine years of engineering skill.